सब्सक्राइब करें प्रेस करें बेल आइकॉन और पाए मुंबई नवी मुंबई एवं बॉलीवुड की ताजा तरीन खबरें Twenty-fifteen was a special year for Croats, not only because Croatia got its first female president, but also because Croatia got an unbelievably stunning and attractive president. Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, dear friends, thank you for inviting me to the second conference of the Association of Croatian American Professionals. Kolinda Grabar Kitarovic is a moderate conservative who styles herself as a woman of the people. Prior to becoming the president, the 46-year-old had held the post of foreign minister, ambassador, and NATO assistant secretary general. In an interview to the press, President Kolinda had said, "I never gave up my convictions, and I still invest in the same values. Homeland and family are my life choices." Croatia is also particularly interested in the open door policy and enlargement. We believe that it is a political process and also a process of reforms that's very important for the aspiring countries and serves as, as a catalyst for their reforms. An energetic politician with a gentle smile, she often emphasizes that she is a country girl who had a happy childhood, being raised in a modest butcher's family. President Kolinda was born in a village in the hinterland of the Nordic Adriatic port of Rijeka. According to her, my mum is my hero. She is the one who nurtured my ambitions. Her rural past has left her with manual labor skills of which she is proud. President Kolinda is probably the only woman in NATO who knows how to milk a cow. She graduated in English and Spanish at Zagreb University before obtaining a master's degree in political science. She joined the conservative HDZ in the 1990s and was the European Affairs and Foreign Minister from 2003 to 2008. After that she became Croatia's ambassador to the United States until 2011 during which she was named NATO assistant secretary general for public diplomacy becoming the first woman to fill that post <music> President Kolinda is praised for her eloquence and firm debating and represents moderates within HDZ Fashion experts have often criticized President Kolinda over her rather tight outfits, her hair tied up, and the false lashes she does not want to give up. But it doesn't matter to the president herself, who believes eventually the world won't remember someone's hairstyle, but people will rather remember one's smiles that opens all doors. President Kolinda has a daughter and a son and describes her husband as a professional dad. Bureau Report, NMTV News.